is how you broke through the rookie wall. This is it, man. I got to give this guy all the credit. I mean, Xavier changed everything. He told me how much you helped him this season. Well, it took him a while, but once he came to me, we were able to figure out what works best for his body and his style of play. Yeah, and diet. Especially that. So what kind of things did you really need to work on? Uh, mostly balance, man. My balance was, was way off. Yeah, if you don't work on it, it's going to be off. It's inevitable. It's very rare that anyone has a good balance of strength, flexibility, and core strength. That's funny. You wouldn't think that about elite athletes. You know, we have one player on the team that's close. Justice came in that first day and just has that build, you know, like a boxer. Prez here is a great athlete. We just mm -hmm. had to fine-tune it. Yeah, and it paid off. So it sounds like you're going to keep up with it? Oh, definitely. I'm going to try. I mean, I'm trying to hire this guy in the offseason to stay ahead of the game. Offseason. There is no offseason for champions. I like that. <laughs> I got it from someone smart. You should write that in the training room. Just get a tattoo right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. maybe a tag. Yeah. No, but this guy's the best, man, really. Yeah. I Let's mean. Say that again? This guy's, he's all right, really. That's what I, that's what I meant to say. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody else want to say nothing? So, they going to trade you, man? Who knows, Ice? They can't trade you guys. You guys are the future of the team. You're the Florida oranges or the nectarines, whatever, man, or orange juice. They can't trade Yo, you guys. Ice. Ice. Chill, bro. Well, I can't Chill. speak my mind in the shop. It's the shop. Why can't I talk about what I want to talk no, about? No, no, no. Relax. We're not focused on that right I now. I mean, you're right. Ice, they're making a mistake, man. Me and Jess are like the Jordan and Pippen 2.0. Hey, man, look, it's all good. Everybody knows I want to stay here, so I guess it's up to them. Yeah. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. We want you here. I'll tell you that much. Yeah. Appreciate that, man. I mean, I don't know what it would be like getting a haircut someplace else. And I can't <laughs> really afford to lose the business, so. That's yeah. what this is about for you, right? No, it's basketball reasons. It's also business reasons. That makes I'm sense. I'm a barber, man. I do this for a living. Well, if I ever get traded, I'll tell you, I'll come back here just to get my hair cut. Well, that would that. be logistically that stupid good. for you. Then I'll fly you out. Oh, yeah, that, that's great. Yeah, fly me out. That makes more sense. Thanks, man. Nothing else left to say. I'm a professional basketball player, so wherever they pay me to play, that's where I'm going to play. Now, with that being said, I love what we're building here. And I think we have a chance to do something really special. That's it, guys. Instead of being about justice. I mean, it's a big time distraction. But at the end of the day, it's a game, right? And I gotta play. Yeah. yeah I mean, I agree. I mean, we're trying to build something here. And I felt like we were making progress. So, to be honest with you, it's a little ridiculous. I mean, just let us play ball and see what we can do. We're just getting started. Thanks, Fresh. For what, man? Look, I'm sick of all this trade talk. Yeah, me too. But you had my back back there. Of course, man. Orange juice, my friend, on and off the court. That's right. So we got a tough one coming up next, man. So we got to go out there, put on a show, let them know that we got to keep this thing together. Orange juice. Thanks, man. <laughs> oh, man. You said this? Yeah, I said that, man. It's frustrating. I mean, me and Justice are just on the verge of building something here, so spoke my mind. No, hey, look, I get it. I got to run some damage control. But truly, I'm inspired. <laughs> look, Bruce, you don't have to say anything, man. I said it. I meant it. Just let it play out. I do. I got endorsements calling me. Management's calling me. They want to make sure you're still part of the team. Of course I'm still part of the team, man. I'm still here, right? Yeah. And look, if they trade me, hey, I'll go play hey, wherever they're not they trading you. How do you know? I promise they're not going to trade you. You're king of the town. They are not trading the king, all right? I'm going to take care of it, and just trust me on this one. All right. I'm going to handle it. You're going to handle it? Handle it. Ow. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Thanks, Bruce. Yep. Appreciate it, man. Yep. Big bucks, Bruce. Yep. How do you feel about this trade possibility? <laughs> I know you got to ask, but uh, look, I don't know if I can talk about it. Look, it's me. I'll keep your name out of it. I, I just want to know how you feel about potentially losing your best friend on the team. You know what? No comment. Prez, I'd look at this as an opportunity. A lot of times, players don't realize the power they have. If you really feel strongly about it, you should say something. Look, I don't know if I believe that. All right? Things are being worked out behind closed doors, and I don't want to get into the politics and the back and forth. I just want to play the game. 
Okay. I won't pressure you. You know where to reach me, though. All right. Thanks, Jay. Just like that? 